Welcome everyone to another episode on our channel. This time we're talking about Lucy Liu, a wonderful actress who became visible, at least to me, during the Allie McBeal days that lasted for about five seasons. She was on the show four of the five seasons from 1998 to 2002. She also did two movies, um, Charlie's Angels with Cameron Diaz and Drew Barrymore. Barbie actually came out with Lucy Liu, Drew Barrymore, and Cameron Diaz, but she happened to have the best sculpt, I thought anyway, of the three. And so she became like the second Barbie that I own, the first one being Cher and the second one, Lucy Liu. I did eventually get uh, another head of Lucy Liu at, with a haircut. And the thing about haircuts with Barbies is that they kind of get out of control. They take on a life of their own, and they just really poof out once you cut their hair. So I did two things to try to tame their hair down with this particular figure. I used uh, hot glue to get the hair closest to the scalp, more attached to the scalp, and then hair gel to try to tame things down. Anything somewhat waxy that doesn't leave any residue is probably going to be good in terms of taming hair down like this. And, and it worked out pretty darn good. You put a Barbie head on a, a very articulated body and you can get a variety of, of poses. I kind of wanted to go for the Charlie's Angels kind of martial art kind of stuff going on in that movie. I wish I could have added the two other gals, but again, the head sculpts in their cases I didn't appeal to me. So here we have only, unfortunately, Lucy Liu. She looks good in blue, though. Her hands have a very nice pose in terms of a martial art flair. We will pause for a second and then just turn around a little bit so you can see her a little bit more closely uh, from different angles. I did something slightly different with her in reference to the stand. I put her arm on the stand since I had her kind of in a kneeling position, half kneeling position. So this gives her a little bit more balance. I'm sure this is not what stands were designed to do, but in her case, it seems to work very well. So um, she's, she's so flexible that I've got one leg kneeling and one leg, you know, perpendicular to the ground. It, it, uh, it's, it's well balanced. I think even if I took the stand out, she'd still remain in this position, but that's just an extra source of support for her. Let's uh, turn around and see her from different sides. She does have nunchucks around her neck. You can see it here. You'll see it better on the, with the close up. Yeah, we've got a pretty balanced pose here going on. And her hair is pretty, pretty shiny from all that gel. <laughs> anyway, there she is. Lucy Lou. Here's a better close-up of her. You can see the bright blue outfit, the white shirt underneath. There's not much to see in the back, except that the outfit does fit her. <laughs> and the hair is so nicely shiny. It is full of gel. That's all I can say. You can see, hopefully, the nunchucks around her neck. So she is definitely ready for action. We just did this video for fun to show you what can be achieved even with a Barbie head, as long as it's on 
a very articulated body, you can you can achieve quite a number of different poses. It's definitely a shame I couldn't put her together with Cameron Diaz and Drew Barrymore because I would have loved to have created a Charlie's Angel trio. But here's one last look at her. I hope you've liked what you've seen. If you have, consider giving us a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel. In the meantime, everyone, have a great day. Thank you.